Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Ryan, aka Outdoor Nerd, out again with another Hunter Call of the Wild. Um, today we're gonna um, go back to the New England map and see if we can find any um, new diamonds, new locations. Probably, hopefully, finish up, up some of the main or the side stories. Um, we'll have some fun with that. I'm gonna follow the road. Looking at the scanner. We have a few diamonds out there. No great ones, obviously, and a few with a rare fur type. Not specifically targeting anything right here. Again, I just use this to see what's over there. And if I, you know, find a diamond, if I know it's legendary, usually, like, because I don't have, like, the cheat sheet or anything in my hand. So, and this also helps, too, to help you guys if you look up top of what I put down. Even though I could see a little like where I put on the map, so that's how I use usually do that situation. So if you feel like that's cheating, that's on uh, your your call. But my call is like I use this to help me and help you at the same time get the stream a lot more organized and a lot more um, friendly when it comes to like getting the animals down. That way, not only that, um, on edits you could uh, see like you know like hey, it doesn't take them too long to find these animals because again. Don't use the dog as much. Just a personal choice. Oh, we got a turkey. Let's see if I can shoot it with a. Uh... It goes down, it goes down. Oh, I got it! <laughs> Snipe! So, right by the house. Uh, I'll keep it right there and track it down. Ice? If you, chat, if you saw that, I just got through the trees and was just like, all right, it should be a shot. That was a long shot, too. No rare fur type with that, of course. It looked like a very just common brown, as you see on screen, um, turkey above my head. Um, but we take those regardless. We just want to practice our shots, especially for like uh, birds in general, because again, I don't do the particular way of like actual bird hunting. Okay, there's a moose right down there. Let's see how far and how big. There are two diamonds about, but doesn't mean they're there. If there's one loner. Okay. Alright, let's see. Damn it. Oh, okay, so he's just a very easy moose. If he gets close, I'll just take the shot. Like that. Should be not down. I think I didn't get in a vital spot. He's just gonna run away. No, I got him! Ooh. Ooh, your boy's getting better at these uh, sh long distance shots. And on t uh, two in the same area. So, like, this turkey got two shots on him so i got him in the clipped him in the wing but then i got him right in the uh back side of the uh flesh intestines that was a good shot but that moose is down so we'll go collect that moose i know i said i was like hey let's just do some other stuff but wanted to make sure that my hunting skills at least my uh shot when it came to like certain areas has been a lot better than the last time you guys have seen me play so with um the eagler i was always spotting Majoritively, just being like, all right, dude, you're at this. I got this um, moose that's like right over here. Or we are mostly doing, yeah, for. We have both done Silver Ridge. Is that male? No, it's a female. That's whatever. And uh, Yukon Valley. Again, two of my favorite maps. Two of the best maps for uh, grinding money, personally. Anything with um, a North American bison. Is an easier grind to get money on, because um, the unfortunate part with bison is you have to like you have to get a really heavy weapon. Usually, the best way to do it is you do buy certain packs. Like he got the uh, muzzle loader pack, so he was just using muzzle shots since the ammo was also cheap to get those going. And then what I did was I just built my way up 
kept making mistakes, and then once I hit a certain point, I got the 7 mil, which you just saw me use. That's like my go-to big game hunt uh, shot, because of how easy it is to have for scope and easy to uh, register. But we're going to get this boost right there. Oh, wow, look at that. Almost bottom-wise to a hard shot, which would have been awesome to see, but, you know, got him while he was turning. It was a good opportunity, and I took it. Uh, we're going to ignore that whitetail deer. It would be fun to chase it around, but I don't know exactly where it went. It could have went left, right, or down towards, I believe, we're right by the river. Uh, it could have went down there. So we're going to go back to the ATV, unless it despawned. It did. Of course it did. Okay. But we're just going to then just go to the location of the... Another move. Okay. <laughs> I keep side-dragging, but... That's what I love about these doing... Is this... This is exactly what a New England Force would be like. Like, you're, like, moving around, trying to see, and, um... It just pops up, like... My gosh, those golden eye. Okay, I got... I, they need a fix, by the way. If, if um... Expansive Worlds is watching us, I doubt it. Um... They need to update the golden eye call again. It was better on Revitulli Coast, and then after this update, it's just been, like worse for some reason i don't know why and also this like little line i don't know if you see it right underneath the uh the uh, binoculars is annoying i also there's a bunch of stuff i've been like trying to post on them and they're like either saying oh it's being worked on it's being fixed you know and i haven't heard back in like days months so definitely would like to get more i know you're probably understaffed right now that move, i didn't see that moose why is he saying he's like right in front of me He's like, oh, he's right below me. Oh, and he's gonna be going away. All right. And he's just gonna keep himself right there. Okay. You gonna move? There you go. I'm like, what are you doing? All right, back to what we were. 